Hey, I'm G from the Cubs Chaos. Welcome to a game called The Shopping List. Now, all you have to do is get all the items on your shopping list. It's a horror game, so maybe it's not going to be that simple. We're about to figure it out right now. If you guys cool with that, you down with that. Everybody get ready and buckle up, because here we go. Don't trust a stranger. You didn't have to tell me that. I already knew that. Like, I would never trust a stranger. What are you talking about? If you trust a stranger, then you probably enjoy getting killed. I'm really going to miss my hometown. I hope moving to the city will give me more opportunities in life. Well, I see the future and it doesn't. Oh man, I almost forgot. What'd you forget, my mans? I have to finish my shopping list before I crash at my new apartment. Dun, dun, dun. I'm sorry, I just had a popsicle and I'm feeling freaky deaky right now. I don't know why. It was sugar free too, so I shouldn't be acting like this. At 12.25 AM, we're about to do some shopping right now. And yeah, this place is so damn empty, but I don't care. Press tab to check your shopping list. Press space to autoplay dialogue. Let the shopping begin. Thank you, random sign that just popped out on my screen. I appreciate that. So let's see. I have to get milk from the grocery store, shampoo from the body shop, toy from the toy store. I have to get a toy from the toy store? What do I need to get, a sex toy? Hmm, honestly, I could get used to living here. I just hope these stores are open at night. Well, this one seems like it's open at night. I need to get chocolate from the toy store? When the fuck would I ever get chocolate from a toy store? Unless it's like one of those secret chocolate covered gummy bears. So let me talk to this uh, sleepy dude right here. Wake your sleepy ass up! Uh, uh -huh. who the hell are you? Nut dust? What a stupid name. What kind of weirdo would name anyone something like that? My mom and my dad and they are scholars. Anyway, what can I do for you? Uh, well, do you happen to know where the milk is? I mean, he better. He works here, right? The milk? Yeah, it should be over by the soda and drinks, whatever. If not, come back here and I'll check the supply stock. Now, leave me alone and let me rest. All right, Baldi's basic son. Drinks are right here. It says milk out of stock in big ass letters. So, I guess I need to go back to my guy. Even though he went back to sleep. Honestly, if it was on the night shift, I would do the same thing. So we gotta wake him up again. Hey yo, hey yo, Baldy. So did you find what you're looking for? No, the milk is out of stock. All right, no worries. I'll take a look back here for you. All right, Jordan, give the customer the milk. No, it's my milk. No, if they want my milk, they gonna pay extra. Pay extra. All right, so you're gonna have to pay extra for the milk. Choose your payment amount. What the fuck? Fuck it. Give you a thousand dollars, my boy. You like that? Musty milk, too. I bet that shit smells hot. Hey, I'm sorry about before. I get grumpy when I'm tired. I've barely gotten any sleep. You know, the disappearances that has happened around here lately. You don't know? Well, just take my advice and finish that shopping of yours before it gets dark. All right, bye-bye now. All right, give me my musty milk. That's mine. Why are you boo-hooing? Musty ass. Dusty ass! I bet he's the one who made the milk musty. So what do I need? I need nothing. I actually need nothing. Okay, so I am going to get Zifuk out of here because this vibe is all off. I'm not feeling the vibe right now. But there's some dude with his arms crossed. Hello, my good man. Hey, you! I'm gonna need to see some ID before I let you continue down this path. It's a strict security procedure that we have to follow. After this week's latest events. Now, get over here and hand me your ID. Shit, I lost my ID before I came here. Well, what do I do now? Do I have to go back? Hey, Ruben. Oh, shit, you old as fuck. Hand it over. Lie, lie, or lie. Well, if those are my only options, I guess. Uh, I left my ID in the car. Just give me a minute and I'll be right back. Fine, just hurry up, will you? Also, my eyesight is really bad. So you better not do anything cheeky with the card now. Maybe I can find something that looks like an ID card in the dumpster. Yeah, with his old ass eyes. It is old, saggy balls. I know that they're saggy. His wife told me. So let's search the dumper. The dumper? Let's search the dumper, bro. I'm done with this. Wait, moldy milk? Musty milk? Wait, why do I have musty milk? Is that my musty milk? Hold on. Wait, why did I put my musty milk in the trash? There's a missing poster. And I said I was gonna search the dumper, bro. The dumper. I got a dumper in my back. Yeah, that's Ruben. Damn, that dude was buff. His name is Billy Seps. And yeah. All right. So we're gonna borrow that. And we're gonna let this man know 
that we got the seps, my boy. Took you long enough. Sorry about the delay, but I got what you wanted right here. Huh, let's take a look here then. You sure this you? It's a little blurry. They don't make them like they used to. What? Your eyes? All right. No glasses. Hey, uh, you promised this is you on the card, right? I promise. Then piss off. Why did you need to see my ID then if you tell me to piss off? You make no sense. Damn, what the heck? Why does this dude got a hella ass though? <laughs> what? These police officers in this town kind of hit different with these bodoinkies. All right, so I guess I'm going to go over to the next store, which is the body shop, wherever the hell that may be. This town sucks ass too. It's like so quiet and there's invisible video game barriers. Oh wait, what's this? This is the music box. Randomly. This brings back memories. When I was a little fuck weasel. I was actually right. He was a little fuck weasel. 1975 though. He led her to his kingdom where he was joyfully received and they lived for a long time afterward. Happy and contented. Thank you, mom. Wow. Wasn't that story exciting, sweetie? Dad was very good. <laughs> You're so cute. I love you, sweetie. I love you too, mama. Oh, mommy. All right, dude calling her mommy milkers and shit. That was a very random flashback. Blurry as hell too. I think I have that eyesight of that police officer, but that was cute. Thanks for showing me that. Anyway. Let's go over here. The body shop. Okay, so things unlock when you like trigger random events. I get it. I see what we're doing here. I'm picking up what this game's putting down. Love your booty. I want my booty to be loved. Hello, Aggie. Why the long face, you know what I mean? Oh my gosh, like, hi. Welcome to like the body shop or whatever. How can I help you? Hi, well, I just need some ordinary shampoo. Anything is fine, really. Anything? Yeah, anything. Yeah. Give it to me. Great. We only have three shampoos left, which is superb since you have any shampoo, right? Yeah. Oh my gosh, great. No one has ever bought them in like two years or something. Don't know why. I think they are great. You can choose between Gusto, Greasy Gramps, Scott's Saucy Sham O, The Poo, <laughs> and Basic Strawberry Shampoo. Well, I think I want that because I'm a basic ass bitch. So let's go with basic strawberry shampoo. Oh, basic strawberry shampoo, great choice. Hmm, you seem unsure of buying it. All right, you can try it out for free in the Palm Lake shower that we have in the back. Come back here after you're done. Do I really want to do that? Bye. I thought it said ba, like some sheep type shit. Okay, so we got the basic strawberry shampoo. I think I'm gonna try it in the back. I feel like something weird is about to happen in the back. I'm kind of nervous. It better not be like really shitty and stinky in here. Oh my God. What is this? What the fuck? All right. Let's try the shampoo. Put it all in my hair. This smells as basic as expected. Yeah. But it definitely has to smell better than that freaking gusto greasy gramps. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. At least I got to try it out before buying it. I'll take it. There's something we got me isn't there. Oh. Okay. I was kind of nervous. I thought something was definitely right behind me, just watching me. Aggie, I will take it. So, what you think? Are you gonna buy it? I guess so. Finally, I mean, great! That will be $9.99. I guess I can afford it, even though I gave that other guy a thousand bucks for some musty ass milk. So nine ninety nine. Thank you for your purchase. I'm surprised that you're out shopping this late. I'm surprised too, actually. We barely got any customers at this time of day because of the disappearances. The only ones that have been here today are you and some creep that looked at me through the glass window while you were showering. Oh, fuck. Nah, that doesn't matter, really. Just be careful out there. For me, it's not safe being out at this time. Bye. Well, she said that somebody was watching me through the window. But this shit looked tinted as a freaking FBI car. So I'm freaked out.
Let's exit the body shop. Somebody out here? I bet you somebody's out here. A stone cold killer. A stone cold killer. A killer that's stone cold. Nope. Oh, fuck. Oh, no. Flickering lights. And is that blood? That's blood. Oh, shit. All right. Well, I'm fucked. What is this? Timmy's Toys? I would not enter a toy store called Timmy's Toys. Not even if I was held at gunpoint. Got me fucked up. All right, let's see who's working over here. Timmy, I'm here for your toys. This person looks like a serial killer. Like, they look like they just got done killing, and I haven't even seen his face yet. Let's see. Oh, yeah, look at those eyes. Uh, hey. Uh, how can I help you? Well, I was looking for something cute to put in my new apartment. You got any toy or stuffed animals you could recommend? I'd also like a chocolate bar. Chocolate? Uh, hmm. Let me take a look in these boxes. Meanwhile, you could do something for me. I'm sorry, I'm in a bit of a rush. I don't think I can. If you want my help, you better help me back. Times have been busy lately. Uh, Alright, what do you want me to do? You know that amusement sign by the entrance? It's supposed to be glowing, but the wires are all messed up. So I want you to check them out. Fine. Really? This googly-eyed freak looking east and west? My man's is a serial killer, dude! Come on, nut dust, get with the times. All right, so I can't have toys and I can't have chocolate until I fix these wires. They're actually right here. <laughs> I'm just being silly. I'm being a clown. Oh, what the? Okay. Um, let's see. That's where it starts, right? So if it starts there, then um, the fuck that, that got it. There. You happy now? Slitty on me titties, mighty. Wow. You actually managed to rewire it? Yeah. Well, a deal's a deal. Here's your stuff. Thanks. <laughs> I said thanks before he said thanks. Hey, I have a quick question. Everyone I've talked to today has warned me about the dangers of being out at this time. Is it really that dangerous for me to be out right now? You're asking this guy? Don't listen to them. People don't like when new people come into this town, so they just try to scare them away with the usual reason. There's a killer on the loose, blah blah blah. It's just proper bullshit. Just ignore them and move on. Alright, bye now. Well, that was an awkward conversation. I'm just gonna head on out of here with my chocolate and my new toy that I'm gonna decorate in my apartment. I feel like there's a face that's gonna pop up every time it does that bullshit. Like, it's kind of annoying. I need printer paper from the tech store. Okay. The music's different. It's kind of settling in a little bit creepier. The deeper I go in this town, the less I just want to be here. Fook. This game's actually really creepy. I'm not even gonna lie to you. Printer paper from the tech store, flowers from the florist, and fresh meat from the slaughterhouse. Oh, fuck. Damn. Okay, this game just like did a 180 with the vibes. This is not passing the vibe check. I'm really not feeling this right now. What is that? Is that the tech store? Oh shit. Is that somebody right there? Bro. Oh, that's a table. Fuck, I thought that was a serial killer. There's a rose right there. This brings back memories. Another one of your mom? Come on, man. If you're gonna show me your mom, she better be a baddie. 1979. All right, so he's four years older. Oh, shit. She ain't a baddie. She daddy, though. I'm gonna miss you. 1943 to 1979. How old was that? 53, 63, 73. She wasn't even 40 yet? I love you, Mom. I love you too, Nut Dust. Watch over your brothers and sisters. This is CNN. I love you, Mom. I do, I promise. What? Oh. My character automatically looked in that corner. That was kind of weird. It is so damn dark. The tech store should be close by. Thanks, man. What was that, Nut Dust? Nut Dust said something, but then stopped. What is this, bro? Hold on. I'm running. I'm running. I'm power walking. I'm power walking. I'm not because I'm scared, but I'm just power walking. 
Tech store. Come on. Let's get techie with it. Get me in here, baby. Woo! I wasn't scared. My nipples are sweating, though. Jesus. What is that? What the? Uh-oh. Uh, activate Android. Oh, my. So you say it three times. So let me see. I need to order that. And there we go. I wish I could have just ordered this on my own phone off Amazon. Okay. Oh, uh, where's the billing? Do I just swipe the credit card on your ass? Alright, let's go. $2.99. There we go. <laughs> Bye month complete. Wow, wow, wow. Thank you! Where did that printer paper come from, though? Anyway, let's go get some flowers from the florist. Almost finished. Oh, shit, what's down here? I don't care, I don't care, I don't care, I don't care. I really don't care. Oh, fuck me. Oh, shit. What? Why? Why? Por qué? Stop! Oh, no. My guy's walking around a little wobbly, everybody. Oh shit. Oh. The fuck who does that at night? Who does a little turn and then just goes back? Who does that shit? Huh? Serial killer vibes. Come on now, pop that head out. Pop that head out. I will bonk you on the head so fast. Don't even play me. Don't even play me. Watch this, everybody. Watch this. You know what I do. You know what I do. You know why I'm here. Come on. Show me something then. Yeah, that's what I freaking thought. With your gross ass bowling ball head. <gasps> Trash cans that just fall over in this town? What the hell kind of place is this? It says missing. It's a missing poster. Ashton Garcia. Reward 1200. Please find my little boy. I can't find it when it looks pixelated and shit like that. That could be anybody. What the hell is you talking about, baby girl? Anyway, I need to go to the florist because I need some flowers. This place seems off. You think? I mean, what was it? The toy store guy? The trash can tipping over? The missing poster just floating out of nowhere? The guy poking his head out? Closed road. I don't give a damn about closed roads. The closed roads should be worried about me. There you go. See what I do? Why is there a random truck here? What's up, my boy? What's up, my boy? I should jack that car. Grab that auto style. Anyway, and we're talking about stealing. The only thing I'm trying to steal. What the fuck? There actually was somebody in there. That was random. There was actually somebody in there. <laughs> Yo, that's kind of creepy. Anyway, get me in this midnight florist. The door is locked. All right, steal the flower. <laughs> it should be open. The owner is probably taking a break or something. I'll keep an eye out. Well, you want me to go in the back? Can I go in the back? I don't know. Oh, there's a bike. Okay. I have a feeling this is the owner's bicycle. She must be in the store. I'll just knock, I guess. Okay. Please, 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 please. Hello? Oh, get the fuck out of here. I'm sorry. Hey, what's your problem? Leave my family the fuck alone. Take whatever you want. Just don't hurt us. I'm not the bad guy, I think. Da, da, da. Can I just have that flower? I'll just grab this rose then. Yep. I did not mean to offend or intrude or all the above. But I'm just taking that because um, it's part of my list. It's kind of a thing I have. What the? Come on. It just started raining out of nowhere. I'll end up soaking wet before I get to the town's butcher. Da, da, da. Oh, no. Hey. Yeah? What are you doing out here in the pouring rain at this time? I could take you where you're headed. Can you now? 
Just get in the car and I'll take you wherever. I could do with some company. That's creepy as shit. No thank you. Will you accept the ride? Yes or no? What if I say no? Let's see what happens if I say no. No, it's okay. I'll just walk. No, don't worry. It's not a big deal. Besides, you don't want to get your clothes wet now, do you? They're already wet. They've been wet. All right. I guess it doesn't even matter if I say yes or no. I have to go in this freaking bitch up with this car anyway. All right. So I guess we're getting a ride from a stranger. Didn't the beginning of the game tell me not to trust any strangers? Guess I'm gonna... Whoa. Hey. Wait a minute. You're that goofy motherfucker from before. Yeah, I am pretty goofy. Oh, what's up, Ruben? Wait, how do you know my name? From your ID? Oops. Anyway, so where are you headed? I'm heading to the butcher down by the community park. Splendid. Well then, let's get a move on. It's just around the corner, so it'll be a short drive. How did you do that with your car? That was a weird reverse, but it was also magical. Hold tab to back dash. Oh shit. Why can I do that? I don't want to do that. What are you looking at, Rube? Huh? Can I call you Rube? Or can I call you Rub? I want to call you Rub. <gasps> Somebody's following us. R Rubbin. Somebody's following us, my dude. They're about to tailgate! Holy shit! Hey! Ruben, look back! Look back, my dude! Okay. We're fooked. Can I jump out of this bitch? I think you have the child locks on. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. The car's gone. Thank you. Um, well, here we are. Usually I charge for rides like this, but I'll spare you from payment. Anyways, I guess I'll see you around. Have a good one. You usually charge for this? What are you, Uber? All right, I'm getting the fuck out of here. It's too creepy as hell. Oh, later. Damn, not even a goodbye? Not even a handshake? Fuck you mean, Ruben? Anyway, let's go to that butcher. The bastard butchery. He's not even just a butcher, he's a bastard too. I'm gonna call him a bastard to his face. Let's see what happens. Freaking bastard butcher. Cutting up pigs, too. Cut up little winky ass pigs. What'd they ever do to you, huh? You freaking bastard. No wonder. No wonder you're a dumb bastard. Hello, and welcome to Bastard Butchery. Don't be shy. Have a look around. We have all kinds of meat. Meet me by the counter if you need help making up your mind. Was that a pun because you work at a butcher shop? I can smell how rotten this is through the glass. Hey, don't offend him, man. Come on, he's a bastard. I was hoping to ask you for your recommendation. Oh, well, personally, my- <laughs> What the hell? The power never goes out in this area. I don't know what kind of scream I just did. I'm busy as fuck. I don't have time to replace fuses, goddammit. Hey. What, you're gonna ask me to do it? I'll give you the meat for free if you go back in my storage room and replace the fuses. Great. I left some spare ones scattered around some shelves. Yeah, sure, I could do that. All right, cool, I'll wait here. Well, I don't think Nut Dust is exactly hurting for money. You gonna give me a complimentary horror game flashlight, you fuckface? You'll need three fuses. Once that is done, you just need to flip the switch by the fuse box. Thanks for your help. Oh, man, no problem, man. Whatever you say, man. You're dead, aren't you? No pun intended, but you're probably dead meat. So let's go inside the storage room. Let's see how creepy as fuck this is. Oh, it's super creepy. Here we are. Great. This is freaking creepy. There's one. Thank you. Oh, fuck me. Silly, dude. You gotta be joking me. Okay. Guys, girls, girls, guys. We'll figure this out. Pull one in here? No? Holy shit, it is dark. Yo, why are there so many damn doors? What is this? Okay, two out of three. I don't like this. I don't like where this is going. My armpits are so sweaty. And this flashlight sucks Donkey Kong Dong, dude. Fuck. I already know there's a jump scare down here. Like, this is like the most obvious shit ever, too. Come on. If you're gonna pop out, then just kill me already. I'm already dead inside. 
I'm already dead inside! What the fuck? What is that? This brings back memories. How many memories do you have, not dust? Fuck! Wasn't your mom dead? How could I ever forget? Dot, dot, dot. What is it? Like 1980? Oh, dad. You monstrous fuck. You selfish drunk. Mom never did you any harm. Neither did I. Both you and I know mom killed herself because of you. Damn. You ruined everything, you alcoholic fuck. I never want to see or hear from you again. Damn, man. I didn't expect it to be like this. I don't want to associate with you one bit. Fuck me, I even lie about my name to move on from you. Not dust? Who the fuck is that even? <laughs> I didn't even tell my friends my real name. I hope you brought in hell, dad. Your real name is Claire? No, your real name is not dust. All right. So what if the dad is behind all this? Fuck. Let's just go. Let's just go. I'm so scared. I'm so nervous. I don't like the sounds in this game. I don't like anything. No me gusta. No me freaking gusta. Fuck me. Come on. Turn it on. Turn it on. Turn me up. Got it. Whew. Okay. Well, that was still creepy as shit. Lucas better be there or he's dead meat for real. Lucas? Are you here? Oh god, Lucas! Holy fuck! Damn it! Come on, bro. Can I have a slice of leg? Anything? You said I could have meat for free. I'm here to collect. Oh my lordy. What's about to happen now? So there's a serial killer on the loose, right? I have to call the police. Yeah, you do. Yeah, you do. Oh! At least we have, like, a GPS. Yeah, buddy. Why is this door kind of litty on me titties? It looks like it wants to be opened, right? Nope, never mind. Okay. So let's go over to this phone booth. This lonely, lonely phone booth. It's not even a phone booth. It's just a phone. No booth. Phone hold the booth. Okay. Call 911. With our flashlight in our hand. Come on now. Answer. Answer, you rat bastards! What does that mean? The phone lost connection. Oh, great. What? What? I need to hide. Oh, God. Oh, God. Why? 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 Asking why a million times isn't going to answer why. Go. What is this? What does that mean? I don't even know what that means. You know what that sounds like, everybody? Never mind. Let me just stop. I know what it sounds like, though. What is this, Jurassic Park? Freaking bitch-ass T-Rex. Don't you dare. Don't you double doggy style dare. I have to get to my car. You have a car? You've been walking around since freaking Kingdom Come. I can't stay here out in the open. I have to sneak in one of these buildings and exit through the back without making much noise. What the fuck are you talking about? Shut up. Okay, I guess I have to. Even though I literally just ran out in the open and I don't give no dams because I'm that dude. All right, let's go inside this random ass building, everybody. It's time to turn up. I just have to make my way to the opposite side of the building. Really? Look at this flashlight. It sucks nuts. I call the elevator. Okay, why though? Doesn't make any sense to me. Let's go. Hello? Hello, let's go. Oh, rise to floor two. What? what? Who was that? So they were right behind me? Shit. This is not good. Great. So now I have to worry about somebody wandering around these freaking halls. Oh, shit. Okay. Let's go then. Let's go then. Think I'm worried? I am worried. I am actually legit worried. Storage. Maybe I can find something to use in the storage room. Maybe. What is that? I like that there's like the little waypoints. Child's note. 
Dad told me to hide here in the storage room. I don't know why he is so panicked. I hope he'll be back soon. It's cold in here. It's cold in here? Why is it cold in here? Why would you make them go in the storage if it's cold in here? Hold on. You think that I can use something? Minmo cat food. Probably tastes like ass. I mean, yeah, I'm pretty sure it smells like ass too. Okay. Let's see. Anybody over here? Some random ass music playing in the background too. Shit weird. Should I go here? Oh my goodness. What is that? Oh, I can't even go down there. Thank goodness. Oh, fuck. Great. It's him. I don't care. I want him to see me. See me then, bitch. Come see me then, bitch. Let's go. I can't go back now. I guess we're going to the basement. I want him to get me. Fuck it. You bald ass. It was that guy that was driving, wasn't it? I know it was. I know it was. I knew it from the moment I smelled his ass. Come on. We look like we're back in the butcher shop. And I have no stamina. I'm just gonna go, everybody. I don't even care anymore. If he gets me, he gets me. I die. I died because I shopped, and I shopped because I died. What the fuck is happening? Look at this flashlight. Sucks anus. Keep going. Keep going, Jay. The faster you go in a real situation, the less that they can catch up to you. Who the hell are these people? What? Oh my god! I recognize these people. I don't! Who the hell are they? They moved into the city to work at this company. They were the only ones that had night shifts. Damn those night shifts. Damn them to hell. <laughs> now they are dead. With a toy knife left on the crime scene? I need to get the fuck out of here. Go. Holy shit. Those are bodies on bodies. They got bodies for your bodies. Come on. Hurry up. Please. No jump scare. Oh. Whew. I don't like being in buildings with small corners and shit. I'd rather be out in the open. What is that? What is that? Oh, it's like a directory? Oh, it's a highway forest. This is the same area where I entered this town from. That, that, that. I never noticed the gas station on the map. I must have missed it while walking into the town. My car should not be too far away from the gas station. I should check if anyone's working there in the convenience store. Oh no, a convenience store at night? I need someone to call the cops and I might be able to get some gas for the car. That's never a good idea. I just have to follow the path up and then walk into the woods. <laughs> Great. The gas station should be on the other side. Oh, Lord. Okay. Well, I need to go up and then walk to the other side. Great. That's just great, everybody. And this flashlight does not do me any favors. I feel like it's on its last battery life or something. So just go up and then cross or just go until the video game barrier isn't there. There should be a path I can take in the woods at the end of this walkway. Okay. Oh, it's coming up. It's coming up. I see it. Right here, right? Yeah, no? Wow. Okay, tough crowd. There it is. Holy shit. This is not good. This is not good. What is that noise? What the fuck? Ooh. Oh, this forest is hidden. Great. Oh, there better not be like a grizzly bear or something. Oh, shit. That sounds like horny hyenas. And they are hungry. They haven't eaten in years. Come on, man. Just let me get to the gas station. Just let me get to the gas station. Keep going, Jay. I can't really run everybody. So if you expect me to be sprinting my ass off... You came to the wrong video. But here it is. Gas station, baby. You! Yeah! False sense of security! Here we are. Where would my car even be, though? You know? Like, how did you not notice this gas station if you think that your car is somewhere close by? That's the thing that doesn't make any sense to me. You'd think you would have seen this thing, right? And a creepy clerk. Here we go. Jake Forster. Hello, Jake Forster. Oh, thank God. I need your help right now. 
There's this guy following me, and I've seen dead bodies everywhere. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold your horses there, Bucky. What's your name? My name is Nut Dust. Nut Dust. Right then. What can I do for you? I need you to call the police right now. I'm being stalked by a killer as we speak. I feel like this dude is in cahoots with the killer. Ha! Nice try there, buddy. I know that y'all people are just trying to scare us outsiders because y'all don't like newcomers in this town. This is not a freaking joke. There's literal evidence all over this place. Really? Yes! Well, if you're so confident, then prove it. Take this camera and photograph one single piece of evidence. Are you kidding me, dude? Show me the photo when you get back. No way. Okay. Why would I have to do that? And where did you just get this DSLR? What the? Boy. All right. I can't believe that I have to do this. This is ridiculous. This is so ridiculous that it's goddamn ridiculous. But I'm going to do it for you. I think I saw a missing poster by the right sidewalk. By the right sidewalk? Okay, so this is the sidewalk, right? This better be the right one. Shit, I feel like I'm about to see something nasty. Hold on. Oh, no. This little, like, exorcist mode or something. Here we go. This old-ass dude, Hugo Davis. There we go. Got it. Okay. So we have evidence 101. This dude better not be shredded like some beef. By the time we get back, I don't even know. Because that was random that he's asking us for evidence. There was a missing poster sign right outside of his gas station. How do you not know about all the shit that's happening here? <gasps> why is it dark now? Bro, why is it dark now? Jake, here's your evidence. I believe you. I believe you. I've called the police already. I saw him by the window. What? You need to leave right now. If you need anything, just grab it and get out. I need to refuel my car. Can I get a jerry can or something like that? Yeah, sure. You can fill it up by the pumps outside. But isn't the guy by the window? Can I please have a pistol? Please be careful. Please be careful? Why don't you come out with me? The hell? Come on, man. We need some sense to be made in these games. Because sense is making none. Whatever that means. Whatever the hell I just said. But yeah, let me fill up this pump. Come on. Let me fill it. Oh, I have to fill it up from this bitch? Okay. Oh, shoot. Oh, no. Oh, no. Why is it doing that? Where the hell's my car? Oh, I never grabbed my can. <laughs> I have to follow the path behind the gas station to get to my car. <laughs> Yo, I was about to go and not have the can. Oh, shit. Okay, I have to burp. No jump scare, please. I have to burp. Wait, you said the path behind the gas station. I guess maybe this is the path behind the gas station? Because this is a new side of the street that I've never been on. Yeah. This has got to be it. Okay, keep your eyes peeled like a banana, Jay. Like a banana. Like an orange. Like anything that you can peel. What is that? What is that? Oh, shit. The officer got clapped, the blind bitch. Oh no, fuck, my bad, dude. He didn't see it coming. You never see it coming. What is that, what is that, what is that? Is that my whip? That's the whip. That's the whip. That's gotta be the whip. That's my whip? Yeah, that's my whip, that's my whip. Why is my car slowing down? You've gotta be kidding me, dude. You've gotta be joking, bro. Really? What? My tires have been sl Really? I'm really close to my apartment, so I should be able to drive the last bit. Oh, great. Somebody's in the car with me. I know that. They've got to be in the car with me at this point. Because your tires just can't get slashed for no reason. All right, never mind. I guess we did drive the last bit. <laughs> and now we are home. Welcome. Objective, make cereal. Okay. Whatever you need me to do. Damn. This house is scarier than the freaking shopping area. All right. So I'm going to eat some uh, chocolate breakfast. Yummy. With some musty milk. Yum. 
Love that. Wait, milk before the cereal? I don't like that much milk in my cereal, but you need just enough so you can, you know, drink that flavored milk at the very end. Take a shower. Yeah, that's what we do after a long night of shopping. Eat cereal and take a shower. What the hell is that? This is creepy, dude. It's creepy in like a, like a why the hell am I doing all this shit kind of way. But yeah, let's take a shower. This is our shower. God, I would never want to take a shower in here. It's so damn depressing. I'd rather take a shower at that one place where I was using the shampoo. Why am I looking directly out? I would never shower, first of all, with a door wide open. Fuck that. Like, screw all that. Something's gonna pop up, huh? Oh no. This game is like the king of like, psyching you out. <laughs> Turn on the news. Great. Why does it sound like that though? What do you mean turn on the news? This ambience is kind of freaking me out. Police officer Ruben has been confirmed dead. He was earlier this evening found by the gas station near Community Park with three stab wounds in the chest and two by the neck. The police have searched the area but have not found any more evidence to who could be the murderer. Go to bed. Okay. Well, let's go to bed quick. Wait, don't I need to pull my musty milk in the fridge? Who cares? Who actually cares? Do I care? Not really. Oh, fuck. What was that? What was that? Oh, God. Well, I'm defenseless. I'm defenseless. I do have my musty milk. And I am lactose intolerant, so I got that gas in my ass. I knew it. You're just like your mother. Goodbye. Claire. Holy shit. So the dad was the serial killer this whole time? I'm ashamed to call him my father. After everything he did to my mom. And doing it all without a care in the world. He didn't give a shit about anyone. Then he started drinking. He started doing drugs which made him lose hair. After mom's death and after nonstop abuse, I took dad's car and drove off. After a few years of therapy, I could handle the trauma and I even forgot about those memories. Dad hated me. He used to explain in great detail how much he hated my guts after mom's death. After his drug abuse, he looked 40 years older. I barely even recognized him in that toy store. Oh, wow. He moved into the city before me and took out a stress on the locals. So your dad's name is Timmy? And he owned the toy store? But he never got caught. Wait, so did Timmy recognize Claire? That's what I'm wondering. That's crazy. That's some what a twist type shit. Damn. So the dad was the killer the whole time. And she moved into this town to kind of get away from him, but he was there the whole time? Or was he just hunting her there the whole time? Either way, that was a pretty interesting and cool game. A lot of people were telling me to check this game out. And thank you all to those that did. But let me know what you thought about this game in the comment section down below. I like games where you interact with a bunch of people in a town in a creepy setting. And you kind of don't know why they're acting the way they act but you start to like unravel things piece by piece. I love games like this and you all seem to enjoy them too. But yeah, um, that ending was interesting, but it was also kind of weird. It was kind of weird and dad was some random dude. I didn't know that the dad was the guy from the toy store, but I knew that the guy from the toy store was involved in some type of creepy shit. So I kind of called it based on my mother's fear of being stalked while shopping. Damn. Well, the developer of this game did a really good job. And that was impressive. So let me know what you all thought about this game in the comment section down below. If you enjoyed it, make sure you give it one big fat like. And tell a friend today that Jay from the Cub Scouts is that dude.